This local sports report is presented by the Inn of Waterloo, a proud supporter of local sports. The Inn is open and is now offering gym and pool memberships to the KW community. Book a room, hit the gym, and go for a swim at the Inn, located at 475 King Street North in Waterloo. Call 519-804-1130 or visit theinnofwaterloo.com. Wixa Junior Football, the Grand River Renegades on home field Thursday afternoon. They would host the WCI Vikings. Both teams with a pair of wins this season, looking to win out as we edge closer to the playoffs. First quarter, the Vikings here on third down looking to run. Frank C. Ardulo heads right with it. Ronnie Hunter marks him and takes him to the dirt. Then later in the quarter, it's the Rens on fourth needing the first down. Matthew Wu attacks the corner. Dammer Murray hunts him down, and WCI get a big stop in front of the TD line. Then it's WCI looking to build out of their own end. Asu Mazalawa here on the carry, speeding down the far side. He keeps his feet moving, and he's good for a Vikings first down, sending us to the second quarter. In the second quarter, Vikings punt. Jaden Samuels with a great swipe knocks the ball loose, and Jaden pounces on it for the fumble recovery. Later in the quarter, and it's the Renegades back with the ball, and it's a big carry from Tanner Luker. He finds a hole in the middle and aims for the left corner. Rogan Moyer, with a great effort, pushes him out at the five. But moments later, the Rens would find the opening touchdown. Hayden Beavers, with an Olympic diving effort, gets the ball over the pack and over the TD line, so it's 7-0 Renegades. Then, moments later, it's the Grand River defense stepping up. The Viking snap is wild. Logan Shaw breaks the line and finds the sack. Late in the first half, and it's the Vikings looking to respond. It's a handoff to the big man, Asu Mazalawa. He fights off a couple of renegades, and once the Asu train is on his track and steaming ahead, he just doesn't stop. Asu with a 90-yard carry for the Vikings, and it's 7-6. Final possession of the half, and it's Grand River looking to run. Rogan Moyer, flying in with a big tackle, takes down the runner. In the fourth quarter now, WCI still down 7-6 here on fourth down. Noah Mike with a nice rollout spots out Avery Pereira wide open on the left, and he's good for a Vikings first down. And moments later, it's WCI back on fourth down, and it's a mirror play from before. Noah Mike with a rollout into a fadeaway pass that finds Avery Pereira. Avery charges the corner, and he's in there! And the Vikings take a 12-7 lead. WCI looking for the two-point conversion here on this run from Asu Mazalawa. Max Miller standing up the big man, pushes him out, and Grand River stay within five points. Late in the fourth, WCI with the ball, but it's fumbled. Jordan Nguyen dives on it, and he gives the Renegades one last chance with the ball. But here on the Renegades' fourth down, the Vikings' defense would hold strong. Here they are closing down the runner, and it's Carson Anderson getting enough of him to bring him down. The WCI Vikings would run out the clock, and they win an intense one over the Grand River Renegades. This one ending with a final score of 12-7. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.